Now, it will help to train hundreds of engineers who will go on to work on some of the world's most advanced fighter jets. Today at Humberside Airport, a £5 million academy opened to prepare trainees for a future in the aerospace industry. Here's our business correspondent, Sarah Corker. The job description might read something like this. Willingness to work in confined spaces, yep. attention to detail and the chance to work on multi-million pound fighter jets. After finishing school, Liam Stanley was working in a shop in Doncaster. He says training to be an aviation engineer has changed his life. It's always been something of a dream of mine. I wanted to join the RAF when I was 16, so it's always been there, just in the back of my head. In this huge hangar at Humberside Airport, apprentices will learn how to service defence aircraft. Their job to make sure fast jets are ready for action. Each year, the academy will take 60 students from across the country. And they'll work alongside the RAF. From a BA system point of view, we need to recruit over a thousand people over the next five to six years. We actually have an expanding export market and the talent within the export market isn't there, so we're having to home grow it. Once qualified, many will work on the Typhoon, one of the world's most advanced fast jets. It's used by air forces across the globe in combat and to police the skies. The apprentices are destined for air bases like RAF Coningsby. This is where the UK's entire Typhoon fleet comes to get a full MOT and service. And for Humberside Airport, today's investment is significant. I think we've been forgotten in North Lincolnshire in the past. And for an airport to be successful, it's really important. You do explore other areas and we are, you know, developing the business park and BAE and the hotel is just, just part of that, really. Once they've completed their training, apprentices can earn up to £35,000 a year, as the demand for aircraft engineers far outstrips the supply. Sarah Corker, BBC Look North at Humberside Airport.